Hi, my name is Jill Henson, and today I'm going to introduce you to sideline legs from the Pilates mat work repertoire. I love sideline work in general just because in everyday life we're, we're in one normal plane and we're not often on our side, so that just makes us a little unsteady and have to work a little bit harder, which in return is going to make us stronger. Now we're gonna lay down onto our sides. If you want to add challenge, you're gonna have yourself in a perfectly straight line. If you wanna give yourself a little bit of love, you can bring your legs forward just a bit. You also have the option to be all the way down, a little lift in the side belly, or you can be here without hanging out. We're not, you know, watching TV, we're working. So the obliques are active the whole time. All right, so I'm gonna bring it all the way down. You have the choice, and we're gonna start with a little lift of the leg, and we wanna make sure that the hips are not rocking back and the hips are not rocking forward. So I'm gonna bring my hand here to help me stabilize. I'm gonna lift, and I'm gonna flex my foot to come forward while the bottom leg, leg stays really strong on the mat. So I'm gonna inhale forward, and then exhale, I'm gonna point through my toes, extend back. I'm not allowing my upper body to come back and I'm staying nice and strong. I'm gonna inhale forward and then exhale to take it back. We are gonna to go to eight of these. Inhale forward, flexing. Exhale, pointing to extend. And when I extend, I'm lengthening long through the hip. Inhale and exhale. I believe we have three more, bringing it forward and back, careful not to sink the neck into the shoulders. Forward and back. You're gonna bring the legs to meet. We're gonna point to lift the top leg, not too high and you're not letting it turn out. You're staying nice and strong here and lowering it back down. We're gonna lift, point to lift and I want you to flex the foot to lower. And we're breathing. Nice and strong. For three more. And two. I always say I should do these every single day. Now we're gonna circle. We're gonna inhale half the circle, exhale half the circle. Bottom leg is still tight and strong and I still have a lift in my side belly. And for three, two, you're doing great. If this feels harder than it should be because it's slow, I'm telling you, it should be this difficult. Now you're gonna reverse it. So the top leg comes back and circles around. For seven, six, five, four, you're doing it. Try not to think about what you have to do next. Just focus on the moment, this time is for you. We're gonna go one more, and now we're gonna stagger the leg. So you're gonna lift the left leg, the right leg comes to meet it, you're gonna hold and then slowly lower back down. And we're gonna lift, lift, and lower. Lift, now you should be feeling those obliques. And up, up, down, for four. Are you smiling, three? This is so fun. Two, and last one. And from here, we're gonna lift both legs together. We bring them up, we lower them down. And we lift, and lower. For six, five, four. Don't let your arm take over. I say that because mine's trying to right now. Two more, two, and one. Now I'm gonna take it all the way down. I'm gonna bring, if I need to have the hand here to help me lift, I can. I'm gonna try to have the left hand on my leg. My leg. So I'm gonna take an inhale to lift. I'm pushing into my palms, floating up. And I'm slowly lowering back down. And I'm trying not to rock back. And I'm pressing, lifting, and lowering back down. And we're gonna do two more of these. Up and down. 
Last one, and then we get to go to the other side. And lower. So from here, we're gonna just bring it up nice and slow so we can still keep that connection going on. We're gonna bring it around to your other side. How you guys feeling? Fabulous. Just to check in, remember you can be here or you can be here, but we're not hanging out in the um, um, obliques. We're not hanging out in our necks. All right, so here we go. We're gonna make the bottom leg super strong. You're gonna flex the top leg and point to lengthen through that hip. Inhale forward, exhale back. Check in with yourself. Make sure the side belly is lifted. That's next to the ground. And the hand is, the arm is helping us stabilize, but it's not taking over. Couple more. You're doing it. If you're moving, you're doing it. Don't be too hard on yourself. And we come in. From here, we're gonna point to lift, flex to lower. Point to lift, flex to lower. Bottom leg still active. Nice inhale and exhale. Another check-in with the belly. Three, two, and one. Here we circle the leg. So we inhale half the circle, exhale half the circle. A lot of times in mat class, I'll see folks go too big here and then it just becomes a wobbly race to the end. I'm trying to get you to stabilize the hips. So what you need to know is there's a lot more going on here than just leg work. It's this full body activation with a, letting the neck relax. Now we're gonna reverse it for eight, seven, Six, are you smiling? Four, three, two, one. Legs come back together and we lift the right leg, we lift the left leg and we lower. And we lift, lift, lower. For three, four more. I feel my hips and my legs getting stronger already. My obliques are thanking me. And last one. And then we're gonna lift both legs together. Check in with the shoulders, here we go. Up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and then finally, you're almost there. The arm is gonna come out. Hand can be here or on your thigh. I will tell you this side's a little bit harder for me. We're gonna press into the palm and lift. Inhale, uh, exhale, lower. If you feel shaky, you're not along. Press and lift. And we're going for two more. Lifting up, holding, lowering, and last one. Press and lift and lower. Keep that connection. You're gonna bring it all the way up. You did it. I'm so proud of you. Thank you so much for joining in on my workout today. Give me a like and a follow for more YouTube workouts.